Hi you all, um, I'm just stopping by for two reasons. Um, one, to show you all my new hair color. I um, let you all know that I got my hair cut and I got it colored as well. Uh, with the cut, I wanted to give myself some oomph by um, going funky with the color. And um, my hair needs to be washed right now, so this is like non defined just whatever but it's three different colors it's four if you include my natural hair color um, the dark brown because I do still have the dark brown in some spots but I was so fortunate um, I went to too groovy to get the color done and I loved the color that a stylist from there did for me I want to say it was seven years ago and I loved the color and y'all know me in color I don't keep color that long typically I'll get it dyed one way and then when the next season comes around I get it dyed again um but I really liked the color so lo and behold they still had the formula on file from seven years ago of the colors that that stylist used. And so two of the colors um, were used again um, that were the same as the color from seven years ago. But then this stylist also added another color, um, kind of like this coppery color was an additional one. But the one that I had seven years ago was just the red, this shade of red, and then the um caramel which you can see right here so when i got it done the first time it was just the red and the caramel but then she added the little copper color as well to um just make it a little bit funkier so i love it um i think the three colors play very nicely together Oh, the lighting changed so you can see it a little bit better now. So, yeah. So that's my color. And then I wanted to discuss some cosmetics and supplies that I ordered from BH Cosmetics. I've never ordered from them before. I know I'm like um, behind <laughs> as far as that goes. I just never did. So anyway, I wanted to get some more um, like contouring brushes and sculpt brushes. So I ordered their Sculpt and Blend 10-piece um, brush set. And these are them right here. So I'm going to wash them and everything first um, before I use them. But I love how the brushes are kind of low profile because some of them they just there's just too much fluff um and so I like the brushes that are lower because I feel I don't know I just feel that the makeup um stays more concentrated when it's like that so I ordered these and then I also ordered um their travel set well this is the little case and these are the brushes. Some are similar to what I've ordered from e.l.f. in the past, but I don't know. In my opinion, you can never have too many brushes. So yeah, and they, they feel nice. They seem to be pretty good quality brushes. So, like I said, I got to wash all of these up. Um, and then I ordered the Glamorous Blush Palette. It's 10 colors. Love these colors. And I've seen people do reviews on this stuff, and I just never ordered it until now. But these are the 10 colors. Um, I've done swatches of all of these on my skin. And the only one that actually yeah one that I probably won't use is this one because it's a bit too light for my skin tone I think it would work good for someone fair skinned 
but I don't know, maybe it could be a highlight or something, but these are great colors. They are very pigmented. Even me being a chocolate girl, um, they show up very well. And I also ordered the Flawless Brow Trio. Used a little bit of it on my brows today. Love it. And I ordered the Blooming Radiance 3-in-1 Loose Mineral Powder. I ordered it in Deep Cocoa. It's actually a little bit darker than me. Um, I just, well, when I first got it, I just put it on my skin when I didn't have any makeup on, and it was darker. Now, so I don't know if once I put my makeup on, if it'll, you know, blend with it or not, but... It wasn't that much. It was like, um, let's see, it was $5.23. So, and then I ordered these three matte lipsticks, uh, one in passionate, mm, this color. Yes. So this is passionate. I am wearing dark rose now. Which Dark Rose actually reminds me of Max Diva. You see, they're kind of similar. Diva is a tad bit darker, but they're kind of in the same family. If you don't want to spend $14 on a MAC lipstick, this is better. You get to see. See, they're pretty similar. If you don't want to spend the $14, BH. Um, and the lipsticks were three dollars and thirty three cents. Uh, I had a coupon code or something. That's why the numbers are a bit <laughs> weird. And then this is Seduction, which is a very dark shade. So put it on so you can see. Pretty. It kind of reminds me of Max. Um, Is it the, uh, it's not quite as dark as the film noir, but it's, you know, in that family. But that's it. So I spent like 50 bucks and got all this stuff. A 10 color blush palette, brow kit, mineral powder, three lipsticks, and two brush sets. 50 bucks. I think that that is a pretty darn good deal. I'm trying to make sure I, I got everything. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. So that's it. Eight items. Eight bucks. Like, you know, Mac, one brush would be 30 something. So um, I'm pretty happy with this purchase. So if you all have any questions or um, want to see swatches of all three of the lipsticks. Well, I guess I, I have on one. I swatched the Seduction, and this is Passionate. So, very pretty shade. So, that's it. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.